Hi, I'm George, and we're going to be changing Minecraft mob sounds on these bees. To do this trick, you need to make a custom resource pack. First off, you need to have a new folder, and that is named mine Bees Sounds. Next, we need to have a list right here. This is the list of all the bee sounds in the game. And the one that we care about is the exit sound right there. We'll be using that one. Let me show you where you can find this. And for that, let's just open up a standard Explorer window here. Doesn't matter where it is. But up in the address bar, type in percent app data percent. Hit the Enter key. Go into the Minecraft folder right here. And in here, go into Assets, and then into Indexes. And you should see your current version of your game right down here. I'll just open this one up. There we go. All kinds of stuff in there, all these hashtag things in there. You can ignore all that stuff. All you need to do when you want to replace a sound is just to find that sound. And for that, we'll do a search. So I'll go up here to edit and find. And let's do a search for bees and find. Okay, couldn't find bees. Let's just take the S off of that and find. And there we go. That's actually part of a hashtag. I don't want that. Don't want that one. There we go. There's the first one of those sounds right there. Now the rest of the sounds will be right here next to this one. This one is the drip one sound right there. So to make it easier for you, I've gone ahead and I've saved this file here up onto my website. You can download it from my website. There's a link for that in the description. All we care about is this one. Now the first thing we need in here is the folder structure. So I'm going to pull this down. Let's just put this up just like that. There we go. So in here we need to match this structure in here. First you need to have an assets folder. So let's make a new folder and call this one assets. Let's go inside of that one and now we're going to match this set up here. So new folder, Minecraft, go inside of that, new folder sounds, inside of that, new folder block, inside of that one, new folder beehive, there we go. And inside of this one, this is where you'd be putting your new sound file right there. Okay, so our folder structure is now set. The next thing we need is to have two files inside here in next to the assets. We need a pack.mc meta file, and we also need a pack.png file. Let me bring back up our other window. There we go, let's now back out of here, back to the Minecraft folder right there, and then come down to versions, and it's right there. Open this one up and look for your current version of Minecraft. Right now I'm in 1.16.3, and that's right there. So open this one up and look for the .jar file. If you're not seeing .jar, go up here to view, and go over here where it says file name extensions, and make sure that, that is checked right there. Okay, so I'll take this, I'm just going to right drag it down here and copy. Okay, I'm done with this folder now for the time being. And in here, this actually is just a standard zip file. So I'm just going to change where it says .jar to .zip. There we go. And then I'll right click on this and I'm going to open this up in a new window. There it is. Okay, so what you see in here is going to be a few folders up here and then a big long list of these class files. Scroll down to the P's, just about there. There we go. And you'll find your pack MC meta and the pack PNG. Just copy both of these files out of here, right drag like that and copy. There's a pack PNG. It's just an image. And in the pack MC meta, I have mine opening up in Notepad where it says description. I'll call mine B sounds and then I'll save that and then close that out. Now, if yours doesn't open up in Notepad, just right click and come down here, open with and choose default program. And in here, if you don't see Notepad up here, click on more options and look for Notepad in the list. Or if you want to, you can use a different program. Another good option here is to get Notepad++, which is a free download. Now, the next thing we need is going to be inside here. So let's go all the way in. That's right here. We need to have a new sound file. We'll be naming it exit and it'll replace that. Now I have that sound file. You like jazz? I copied that off of the internet and I increased the volume on that a bit and I saved it out as an MP3 file. I like using a program to edit these things called Audacity and it works great. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead now and open up my MP3 file in Audacity. Here's my sound file. It's in stereo, as you can see. Now I need to export this out as an AUG file. Go up to File, come down here to Export, and Export as OGG or AUG. And I'll go into my folder here. Let's go right down to that location, and that's right here. And I want to export this out as Exit. There we go. Choose Save. Okay, and that's all now done. Okay, I'll just close that down. So now I have the matching file name in the right location, and that's our folder structure right here. And we're all set at that point. Just back up here to our B sounds. Let me close this down. Now what I need to do is to zip this up and put it into the game. Grab my three files, hold the control key down, grab these three. Let's go up here to share, click on zip. I'll just call this one B's Sounds, and there it is. Okay, let me bring back up the other drive window, and let's get back into that percent app data percent, enter key, and then Minecraft, and then come down to resource packs right here. So let's copy over this one. I'm just going to right drag this, just go right to here, there we go. I'll right drag this in like that, and copy. There it is, and that's all done.
we're all set to go ahead and put this into the game. So close this down, close that down, and I'll bring the game back up again. There we go, back in the game. Hit the escape key, coming down to options down here, went to resource packs. Let me just uninstall the one I was using right here. There we go. And I'll come down, we'll find the one that we just did, and that's the bees sounds right here. Click on that arrow, puts it over here on the right hand side. That's now been loaded in. Choose done. We'll then reload the game with that new resource pack. And done again, back to game. And now when they come back out of that bee nest right there, we should hear them say, you like jazz. Let's see if this works. You like jazz? There we go. Definitely working just fine. All right, if you like this video, make sure you hit that like button, click on share, click on subscribe, check out my channel for a bunch more Minecraft videos, and I'll see you next time.